Ryan Payne is with me, president of Payne Capital Management. Ryan, I, I, am I right in saying that it was that one statement from Lighthizer that's done the damage on Wall Street? I mean, I also like the fact that you said it could be an executive decision, meaning you don't have to go through Congress. So I think that that leaves a little wiggle room there where we can get a deal done very quickly. So I think that may have weighed negatively on the market. I mean, let's face it. It's almost like minute by minute, right? The deal's going to happen. It's not going to happen. You kind of see the market yo-yo. Sure. But I think the market wants to go higher here, Stuart. But you think that that, st- that statement is going to be an executive decision, an executive yes. agreement, not a full-blown whatever else it could be. That's, that's good news? That's very good news because if a deal can be done quickly, uh, you know, what that could, in terms of the market, you know, the way I look at it is that could, that, could, that could be a big catalyst for the market to move a lot higher here. Okay. I want to go yeah. back to my editorial top of the hour on these deductions, the capping of the deductions. Yes. Um, I'm saying, and I'm, I think I'm right, the one percenters who live in these high tax states are screaming blue murder because they are going to be paying much more in tax. You hear the screams, don't you? Oh, man. Loud and clear. Loud and clear. Um, yeah, I mean, if you look at it right now, and you made a good point, you're already seeing people attrition a lot of these high-tax states, which is already a problem for you know, states like New York, New Jersey, Connecticut. And you add this on top of that, I think it's only going to exacerbate how you know, quickly people are going to be moving out of these states. It's a real big problem. Uh, do you have clients who, uh, I'm not asking you to divulge what your clients are doing about this, but they're, they're talking to you about these deductions and the cap? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Because you're looking for any tax uh, benefit you can find. And, you know, if you look at last year with the tax reform, there's not a lot of places to hide here. You know, you, if you're a W-2 employee, there's not a lot of deductions that you have to offset the deductions that you're losing. Yeah. And, you know, Andrew Cuomo, forgive me. No, go on. Uh, hello, um, Elizabeth. Hello. <laughs> come on. In, come on. <laughs> Remember, Governor Cuomo of New York State said in September of last year, people are leaving New York State because of the upstate weather because of the weather. Now Cuomo, according to Stuart, uh, uh, Stuart, Cuomo (laughs) is saying no, it's because of the loss of the salt deductions. And 1.2 million people left California going into Nevada. And so this is 1.2 million million people between 2012 and 2018 left California to go elsewhere, including places like Nevada. That's over that period of time they left because of the high taxes in California and the high housing prices. So this is a structural problem for these high tax states. Tax Absolutely. States, right? Yeah. Why don't you go to Florida? You're a young guy. You can start all over again. <laughs> I mean, Miami looks really good this time of year. Yeah. But then I couldn't hang with you every week, Stuart. That oh. would just be painful. No pun intended. Have you thought of moving? Seriously? Uh, I mean, you start think, thinking about the taxes that you're paying. And let's face it. I mean, it's, it's full employment now. Um, I own my own firm, so it's I, mean, I can employ myself somewhere else. But I mean, for for someone who's maybe a millennial who's forming a family now, your expenses are going up. Um, you know, there's a lot of other places to find jobs that you don't have to be in New York City, let's say, like you used to, maybe. That's true. Very yeah. true. All right. Uh, Ryan, we'll let you off the hook. We won't force you to tell us that you're going to Miami. But, you know, I'll, I'll send a movie. You're invited, man. You're invited. <laughs> oh, I love it. Ryan Payne, thank you very much, sir. Appreciate Thanks, Stuart. It. All right.